Hey Disney fans, welcome back to my channel. So today for Disney Pin Wednesday, as you can see by the title, we're gonna take a look at a really amazing limited edition set released by Fig Pin Official. Mine did come in the mail today. Um, it's still even wrapped in its plastic here, but we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna get these puppies out. We're gonna take a look at them. They look to be gorgeous. I love the artwork on this box, so stay tuned. We're gonna get all of its details in each pin individually. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna take a look at is actually this little fig pin pin that came with them. Um, this was just in the box along with the princess set that they did make. Um, and it does have their signature pin back on there so you can kind of use it as a stand if you wanted to. But um, this is the official fig pin pin and it says collect awesome. And then of course it's different colors. It's got like little glitter things on there. Um, and then it says of course, unlock with the fig pin app, which I do have that app because the only other fig pin I have is the D23 Ariel. And if you put your um, pins, like there's like an item number on there, it'll actually tell you what number out of the limited edition run your pin is. So definitely go check that out. But here's the fig pin official pin. And then here is the princess pin set. So this is quite the set. Mine is still sealed. So let's go ahead and get it out of the wrapper first. There we go. And let's take a look at the box. So this is, it's a box with a sleeve. So the sleeve of course shows Snow White, Cinderella, Ariel, Belle, and Jasmine. And of course it is kind of in um, order of what the movies were. So I think that's pretty nice. So again, we have Snow White, Cinderella, Ariel, Belle, and Jasmine. I love the artwork that they do for these. They are phenomenal. This was a limited edition pin set. I'm not quite sure. I don't remember how many of them there were, but it was $100. Um, but I do love it. These, there is available on their website right now. You can get these with a the silver back. The limited edition set came with a gold back. So let's go ahead and, ooh, ooh, this is kind of fun and fancy. So there is the box itself that the pins come in. You can see there's some really neat embellishments. It does say Disney Princess Fig Pin. On the back it says Fig Pin Collect Awesome. The Disney logo, of course. Um, I'm pretty sure, yeah, these were hundred bucks. And then it looks like, yep, it's got a magnetic enclosure here. And when you open it up, they're still covered <laughs> by this Unlock Awesome um, little just protector sleeve, I guess is what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna flip around so that this is what's available, but wow. Okay, so here are the pins themselves. We do have, of course, Snow White, Cinderella, Ariel, Belle, and Jasmine, and um, they each fit in here perfectly. I'm gonna take out Snow White first. And you can see here, they do come in each, come in their own little case, so um, they are individually protected. There's the artwork. And these just pop right off from what I remember from the D23 one. So let's just go ahead and get Snow White out here. Okay, sorry about that. It took a bit to get her off her little backer card there. But here is Snow White. Lots and lots of different color enamel, beautiful metal work. I love this pin. She's absolutely gorgeous. On the back, you can see it does have like what we would consider a sand back if it was um, a Disney pin, which these are Disney. It does say right there, Disney and then fig pin. Um, it doesn't say what the limited edition size is on the back. I think it was like 500. I really wanna say it was 500, but you can see there are three pin backs. They fit into this little um, rubber backer, which then of course goes onto this stand. So that way your pin can actually stand up if you want it to. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and put that back on here so you can kind of see how that works. Let's do that here. It does hold them pretty securely too. So and then when you have her, she just stands like this. And then of course, her little back card there gives her a pretty little backdrop to look at. But uh, there is Snow White. So I'm gonna set Snow White aside here, put her little cover back on, keep her safe and protected. Next up is Cinderella. And Cinderella is a beautiful pin, let me tell you. Absolutely gorgeous pin. So took the protector case off there. Here is Cinderella. And again, loads of detail, loads of different color enamel. Um, they don't do glitter embellishments on the fig pin uh, pins, but they do like little sparkle embellishments <laughs> kind of to make it look like glitter on them. So you can see there, she has like little glitter, like sparkle like look type things on her bottom of her dress there. Um, this is a gorgeous pin. I love Snow White. So, and I love Cinderella and I love Ariel. So my three, top favorite princesses are already well represented in this set. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Uh, love it. And the gold doesn't bother me. Like 
a lot of my Disney pins are gold. Um, some of them are silver too. So the gold really doesn't bother me one bit. I don't think it detracts, um, distracts from the pin itself, but a beautiful Cinderella pin. So I'm gonna put her back on her card here. Of course, here is her artwork. And then the part that you see when you have the pin on. So let's get this pin back on here again. And literally what you do is you just stick the posts through the um, stand, push the back back onto it, and then she is good to go. And then this, the cover just goes right back over her. So, and then it snaps down once you have it in place, just like that, and she's protected. Okay, this next one is actually very similar to the D23. So I'm gonna put you on pause real quick. I'm gonna grab the D23 one. Okay, so this next one is Ariel and it's Ariel in her green parks dress. And it's very, very similar to the D23 Ariel in her pink dress. So um, there's n the only difference really is the color of the dress. Uh, otherwise they are exactly the same pin. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this one out here. And here's her artwork. I love that it's like a little display for the, the background of the pin. I think that's really cool how they did that. And then the pin itself is absolutely beautiful oh i love ariel i love ariel so well obviously i've got her right here still um but i love ariel so here is the ariel fig pin from this collection looking fabulous i love the green parks dress um just a really nice big i mean this fills my palm so these are really big pins guys um and there are five so you figured about 20 uh 20 bucks a pin equals 100 dollars. so not bad really if you get down to it um, and they are limited edition. So um, I really didn't have a problem saying, okay, sure, here's $100 of my money. Um, it'll be my Christmas present to myself from myself, <laughs> along with everything else that I collect. <laughs> we'll see how my wife feels about that. I don't know. But there is the Ariel pin. So again, very, very similar to the D23, but of course, different enough that I'm okay with it. The next pin is Belle. And uh, Belle's probably, I mean, she's, I like the Beauty and the Beast. It is not one of my favorite movies. Um, so I don't mind having a few pins of her though, because I think her pins usually are very pretty. So there's her artwork. And then the pin, let's get the back off of it here. Maybe, hopefully. There we go. is of course Belle in her yellow dress when she has the ballroom scene with the beast. And she looks like she's got a couple of books in her hand. Now her face, I think is probably my least favorite of the pins today. Um, I don't think it got, it just didn't come over very well, I don't think. There's more metal work than there is enamel work and her eyes just look like gold blobs. Um, but the pin itself is nice. These are very hefty pins, very thick pins, uh, but that's the Belle pin. So of course, lots of detail, lots of different colors of yellow enamel and white enamel to give it the shading and grading effect. Um, probably not my favorite pin out of this whole batch, but of course, in order to get the limited edition set, you had to buy all five because it came in a box set. So it's okay, I don't mind having her. Um, I'm not gonna get rid of her since this is a set and it comes in a box that has a little slot just for her, Bell stays. So the last and final pin of this glorious set is Jasmine. So there's Jasmine in her case. Let's go ahead and get her out now. Yeah, maybe. Sometimes these things are silly, but there we go. Okay, so here is Jasmine's artwork. And then of course the background shows a key with Agrabah. I guess each one probably has something different for the princess. Yep, Cinderella has a, car a carriage. Snow White has an apple. Belle has um, the rose and Ariel has a seashell. So I guess I should have picked up on that. <laughs> Oops. Oh, I'm so focused on the pin. I didn't even really look at the background card, but it's all good. All right. So here is the final pin. That being Jasmine looking beautiful, holding the lamp, of course. Love the highlights in her hair. Looks like a blue tint. And her outfit, of course, is very stunning. And then there's the back of the pin where it does say Disney and fig pin on there. Um, yeah, this is, I like this pin quite a bit. I actually do like this pin. I don't have a lot of Jasmine pins. So this is one of the few that I now have, but um, I really do like this one quite a bit. It's a very pretty pin. So very grateful to have that one in this collection as well. So after I get this backer on here, 
that will wrap up the fig pin limited edition princess box set of beautiful pins last one of course being jasmine if you guys were able to nab this set before it sold out let me know leave some comments down below um i would love to hear what you guys think of these because these are really some phenomenal pins i really do like these quite a bit i'm gonna put them all up here and just kind of line them up um i a lot of people love fig pins. A lot of people don't love fig pins. I think they're phenomenal. I like the detail, like the heftiness of the pin. I like the fact that they are licensed. I think that is just really, really cool. And when you have limited edition runs like this, I think it's even better. So definitely let me know your comments and your thoughts down below, guys, if you're able to get it. If you weren't, if you're going to get the silver line instead of the gold ones, let me know. Um, these are just a really, really beautiful pin set. So would love to hear your thoughts. Alrighty, guys. Well, again, that is going to wrap it up today. Give some thumbs up if you enjoyed. If you haven't already, do consider subscribing. This is what we do here on my channel. It's a lot of Disney reviews, Disney items, Disney pin hauls, all stuff Disney all the time. So we'd love to have you join the family. All right, guys. Again, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you're all having a very magical day and we will see you real soon.